Hey there, welcome back to the dev channel. Today I'm gonna to show you how to use a sprite sheet and cut it into a bunch of different little PNGs. So you have a whole bunch of different pictures and not just one picture, the sprite sheet, right? Now, this is gonna be really easy and quick. Like this video shouldn't be more than a few minutes. And I'm doing this specifically so in the next video I'm gonna record right after this one. Uh, for iOS development, you can uh, basically create an animation with a, new, with a UI image view, okay? Now, this is also done very easily. It's for like the like button uh, with uh, in Twitter. Like if you know what that is, if you use Twitter, there's an animation when you heart something. It's gonna be similar to that. So if you use Twitter, you know what I'm talking about, right? Now, uh, yeah, it can be done with any other sprite sheet, but yeah, let's go ahead and jump into it, uh, cutting the sprite sheets, bam. All right, so let's go ahead and just knock this out and uh, get it done real quick, okay? So you're gonna need to go to this website, link in the description somewhere, and you're gonna need a sprite sheet, okay? Now the sprite sheet that I'm gonna use is also in the description, and it's this heart one, right? So let me open this up. It's just a heart, and it's got a bunch of frames of a heart. Now I highly suggest you use this image that I have in the description because a lot of sprite sheets that you might uh, be wanting to use or something that, that you uh, came to this video with, uh, they're not gonna be entirely symmetrical and you're gonna end up with some random cut images in half and all that junk. Now, so what I'm saying is just use this image for now, link in the description, and um, then try it out with your other sprite sheets that you came here with wanting to do it with. And then we can see what works. If it doesn't work for you, let me know in the description, okay? So what we're gonna wanna do on this website is go ahead and hit choose file, right? We wanna upload image from our computer right here. And we wanna select our heart image, okay? Now, next thing we wanna do is hit upload and it will generate our, uh, It'll take it in and then we can generate it, right? So you'll see it has our image and then I'll zoom this up a bit just in case you can't see it. And then it's gonna say cutting method. We wanna choose by tile size. Now, the thing about this image and any other image is that they have their own, they have their own, uh, where is this junk? They have their own width and height, right? Obviously. Um, and this one is, 100 pixels high and 2900 pixels wide. So we need to think about our tiles this way, okay? If it's 100 pixels high, then we need to make the height of each one of these tiles 100 pixels. Because there's not, if, if there were like two on top of each other, two rows, then we'd say uh, 100 still, right? And the whole image would be 200. And then for the width, since there's 29, uh, it's still just gonna be 100, okay? Because there's 29 images here. So we need to make it 100 so that they're all even. Okay, so next thing we wanna do is we wanna just hit cut. Now again, this is specific to this image, so if you do 100 by 100 on a different sprite sheet, it might not work the way it needs to. Hey, I bought one of these cars. Well, not a Golf R, but a GTI, but like still, why are they advertising it to me? Mm, maybe I should go buy a Golf R, Never mind. Okay, so what you wanna do is now scroll down and you're gonna see these individual images. So I'll go ahead and hit download frames as zip and then open that and then open this. I tried recording this video like five times and I failed, all right? So that's why I have those all down there. But you'll see that in here, we have all of our tiles now. And these are all the same width and height, right? So the first one, second one, if you hit Command I on both of these, you're gonna see they're both 100 by 100 and they're both centered exactly where they need to be, okay? So now that you have your sprite sheet, you probably came to my channel just to watch this video for whatever reason of your own, but if you're interested in making this an animation in an iOS app, such as the Twitter app, as you can see right here, then we're going to do that in a video that's also in the link in the description, and now you have the hearts to do it with, okay? So let's go ahead and jump into that video if you want. If you don't, don't jump into it, but leave a like and subscribe, and uh, let me know if you're down for more content like this. I'd love to provide it for you. I'll go ahead and see you guys next time.